This will be a quick guide on how to decode BenQ Pro Designer's PD Display Series model number. This is Artist Right. Before we start, subscribe if you're new and hit on the bell icon so you'll be notified every time I upload cool new videos like this. So let's quickly talk about what's in the name. Now, decoding the model number is going to be something that's important, and I don't know if you guys have you know, any type of confusion looking at name, but I see a lot of characters, a lot of numbers. So I want to make this a little bit easier for all of us to really choose a display. So what I'm going to do is pick the PD2706UA as the model. And what we're going to do is decode this model number. So let's start out with the first two characters. Now this would denote the product series. And this would also, when you see this, you can really infer a lot of the inherent capabilities from the product series as well. For example, PD is a pro designer, SW are the photographer, hardware, calibrated display, and all of them that has the SW name in front or the SW characters are going to mean that any display that has those are going to be able to show 99% Adobe RGB. Then BenQ also have, for instance, the EX model, which is the Mobius gaming and entertainment display that has high refresh rates, still amazing colors. So there's more BenQ displays in the lineup, but these are just some examples to give us an idea of what we're looking at. Now, the first two numbers after the product series would be the panel size measured diagonally. So for example, this is PD27. This means this display is a 27 inch. If you see 32, it's a 32 inch display and so on and so forth. You start to get the idea for the naming. Now, particularly for the PD series, the last two numbers denotes the display position within the series. So lower number denotes an entry model, higher number denotes the flagship model. As of right now, what we're looking at in the PD series, we're looking at the numbers that start at 00, zero and at this point in time, or at the point of this filming, it ends at 25. Now, not all sizes and models have the 25 models. Some of them ends at 20, but we're gonna go over all of those in just a moment. All right, the first character after the number, this will generally be two characters, either a U or a Q. U would denote that it is a 4K ultra high definition or UHD that is 3840 by 2160. And if you see a Q, they generally denote that the panel is a 2K quad HD resolution, generally 2560 by 1440 with the exception of PD3420Q. You will get the Q in the end. That means it conforms on the vertical axis to a 2K resolution. However, there are more resolution order on the horizontal axis because it is a widescreen display. But we're gonna talk about that model a little bit later on too. And lastly, if you see another special character after the first character there, the A generally in this situation denotes that it is a model that comes with the ergo arm. So when you're choosing these display, when you want to add them to a cart or choosing which one to buy, if you see the model number, for example, PD2706U, and the one with the UA, the one with the A is the one that comes with the ergo arm. And this is, at this point in time, an option that you have to choose when you are purchasing the display. It is not available as an aftermarket purchase as of yet. I hope that you find this decoding session helpful. If you have any questions or comment, leave them below. Give this a like, subscribe and hit the bell renew and in art we trust.